that once I jump out for this town, if I leave this country, nothing in this life that will make me to come back. You understand? Mm. But even at that, I see no blame man. He didn't get the money. You know, get country where I won't go now, where if you can go no go fish for me. You understand? What I need to do be say not to pressure him. Mm. With time, or okay, God, he go come along. So leave this one with the dog. Come on, anything thief now, nah, no one do him. I beg. No. I confirm, ma'am. Say if he can go, get the money. He get a no be lie. But why did they use you play dumb? Why did they use your heart do jam all over? Did they play with your emotions anyhow? Now what do you not understand? Sigama, I tell you. Now I tell you truth. As my guy where you be, as my suicide where you be. You see this your dream of going to jam? Eh? He could die a natural death. Now me they tell you. What you gonna bring that one now? No, now what you gonna bring that one? And I pray they pray for me. Let me pray out. No, they wish you bad luck now. It'll be bad luck, my. Dear. No, now what you they do? Why you go say? Why you go say the dream could die? Eh? No, why you go? Why you go do like that now? Now guy, you be like wood and poison water. Oh God, oh God, see, I don't like him. Okuku, oh, they say I don't like that. See, clean your mouth, too. You know they behave like that. Now guy, you be like wood and poison water. Oh God, go travel for this village. You did this time. You go happen for your eye. You know they behave like that. See, clean your mouth, too. You know they behave like wood and poison water. Oh God, go travel for this village. You did this time. You go happen for your eye. No, you go there. You go see him. Uh, if not pray, go. They wish me say I don't go travel. Eh, uh, back to sender. Uh, yes. I don't hear her. Back to sender. You go there, I go travel. No, they talk too much. No, I go tell what's in action. Like you. Na actions. Village man. That's uh, why if you say no, okay, go travel and you go happen for your eye. I want to see. You travel, see come out. Give my, give my money. Oh, I should not play. Give my money. Which I don't one? want you now. This is injustice. In the man, I come out your child. How can I pay for a sin I never commit to you? Hey, this is injustice. You hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? No. Oh, God, I I say, where are the truth say I say, I say, I say, I I say, I I say, I say, I say, I say, I Look at you. I say, I say, I I will never go for that place. I will never try it. Yeah? <laughs> And you see yourself, now you begin to recognize that I am the man of the house. Hmm? Ineko. I want to go to that. See, next time you try this nonsense with me, something worse than going for cleansing will befall you. Nonsense. I don't want to go to jail. I'm married with my own money. You come here to make all that for me. I tell you what to do. You're not going to go Stupid woman. Yeah, why? Where are you? God, where are you? You are allowing this injustice. Why are you permitting this injustice? God, are you there? And you're watching this happen to me. There's something about we, the people of this town. We like it when people go straight to the point. So oblige yourself. The gain of this audience I've given to you. Go straight to the point. Chinks Mogolin Sala. You're just one of a kind. Look at the way you just presented it. So mature. Look, let me tell you something. 
I like you and I like you a lot. And if you permit, I am willing and ready to make you my wife. I am in a serious relationship. Oh, come on. You know that serious relationship is different from marriage. But serious relationship leads to marriage. I know. But you know I am more ready than the amateur of a guy. Says me. Say, I just want you to give me a chance. I promise you, you won't regret it. I am not interested. I was not actually expecting you to give me an answer right now. I just want to give you time to think about it. See, there's nothing to think about. I insist, dear. Ponder on all the things I have said. And you can give me an honest opinion. <sighs> Whatever. Can I go back to what I was doing before you came? Sure. Say, I love you. I just want you to give me a chance and I will prove it. I've come here because um, I got information that your husband is not I felt that it's the best time to have this conversation with you quickly. Okay. I'm aware that the men of Obodino have come together to decree that you will go for cleansing. And that you have also agreed to grant their wish. I have been pushed to the wall. I do not have strength nor power to fight back. I'm at the brink of losing my home and I don't want that to happen. If it's going for the cleansing that, that will restore peace to my home, then I'll do it. I'll do it to prove to them that I have never cheated on my husband and I will never cheat on him. Slow down. You, of course, I know, and a lot of people know that you did not cheat on Eloka. You're one of the uh, good women, but then a lot of young people look up to you for good character. So that's that. That's an aside. Okay. Thank you. I'm going to be direct with you, and yet you are not going to go for that cleansing. Hmm? Like I said, I, I cannot fight them. I cannot fight the men in my husband's family. And if going for the cleansing will bring peace back into this home, then I will do it. It's nothing. I'll do it. I've agreed. I'll do it. I'm working on something. Please. I'm working on something. I just need you to just hang on. A little just buy me some time. Okay. I think it's a little bit late. Why? I've already told them I'll go for the cleansing and they are preparing for it already. Oh, well, the same way you told them that you're ready for it, just tell them that um, right now you're not, um, you're not ready. That's it, you know? I, I don't think I can do it. You can do it, just do it. You can. What exactly are you working on? And how is it going to help stop men in my husband's family from asking women like me to go for cleansing? Uh, Anyeti, I'm running out of time. I have to go now. 
but just do what I've told you. But I promise you the next time we sit down, I'll tell you everything. Please, buy me some time. Okay? You can do it. Bruh. I'll see you soon. Unannounced. This is my house, so I don't need to announce to anybody for coming to my house. Oh. Okay? My you mother house is my house. You always have something to say. <laughs> come inside. No, I didn't come to sit. I didn't come to sit. I don't understand. So what, what are you here for? Since you're already asking. And you poorly loaded, just like the woman who will never bring out the money. I will tell you. I am here to collect money for my upkeep. Okay. Well, if that's the case, you have to come back later. It's in a better position to respond to that. Okay? Uh, okay, no problem. But then. Um, since I already told you, maybe you will find me some more thing. Let me just used to hold my side first. Hmm. No matter how small, even if it's tricky. Hmm. No, no. Okay. Let me get it. Alright. And because of you, my base. And because of you, if you can go for don't collect. But because he has a good woman like you, that is shielding him. That is why you never collect. What about your What do you mean by he for don't collect? What exactly is he collecting? No, you have nothing to worry about. Like I said, you have the one who have been protecting him. If not for you, if not for a good woman like you, Ma Basse, Ma Basse Machi. If we don't collect big time. But we are his savior. So bad, bro. Go and get me the money. You can make it 5k if possible. You know, I see the video. <laughs> you will never change. I'm coming. Alright. Make it 5k. Yeah? And I'll go bring 3k. Come. Why did you call my wife and ask her to give me phone? Didn't you have my number? Well, that's my way of telling you that I'm not one of those girls who use I'm dumb. Nkechi. Nkechi here. Okay, Zerede. Ketalokwa. Nkechi, what do you think you're doing? Nothing. I didn't do anything. Moreover, I did not even tell your wife or anything. I just told her you're my business partner and she bought it. And um, I was also calling to check on you since you refused taking my calls. Okay. Uh, anyways, uh, how did you get my wife's number? I know that you've registered a new number. And you're planning on dumping your old number because of me. Mr. Madoka, I equally know you've gotten a new number which is 091-60-71-61-85. Is that not your number? Kichir, who are you working with? 
Nkechi. Nkechi, what do you think you're doing to me? I am only trying to tell you that Nkechi Fekando here is not one of the girls who use them dumb. For goodness sake, I pleaded with you to use protection. I begged, I pleaded with you. But what did you say? You said no. That it means I don't trust you. You kept on doing stuff to me without protection. And was that the reason why you allowed yourself to get pregnant? Get pregnant for a married man? Nkechi, a married man with three, three children in the boarding school. Mr. Madoka, you talk too much. I will only tell you this once. Come and see the men of Ifek and the family. Or are we forced to come and tell your wife the way you did stuff to me without protection? Without using a condom, a condom that I even bought myself. You refused. Why do you have to blackmail me? Why? Mr. Madoka, I never wanted any of this. I know that the women of Obodeno belong to the men of Obodeno. As a matter of truth, I was ready to allow you to come and join me until the man who will make me his permanently comes. But you force this pregnancy into existence and you must take responsibility for it. Or I will show you that I'm a woman of Ubodeno who knows it all. Shut up. You need to shut up. You talk. First of all, it was condom or no condom. Raw or no raw. Now you want to tie me down to a break to to to. Nkechi, let me ask you. Didn't you enjoy it while it lasted? Were you not enjoying it skin to skin, flesh to flesh? I was busy hammering you. It come, it boom, it come, it boom. And you were crying, shouting, Daddy, hada, 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 baby, baby. You carry leg up, you carry head up, you turn up and down, you twist. You now you want to blame me for what two of us enjoyed, eh? You think you can blame me? Let me tell you, Kechi. I am a married man and I have children. Therefore, I will not marry you. Get that into your skull. Mr. Madoka, you lie. Because you will. And it's a must. You lie. Hey, K baby. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, man! Why not a wild dog, Mary? You're too sweet. Eh? I must confess, you are the sweetest girl. I. 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 I will give you 100,000 Naira to terminate this pregnancy. And after abortion, another 100,000 Naira for your shopping. And when you are done with shopping, between now and month ending, <laughs> I am telling you, I will provide all the necessary documents. I will take you to South Africa for vacation. I am telling you the truth. If I am baby, eh? You're kidding me, right? Kidding me, right? I mean it. I'm a man that walks my talk. And after that, eh? Be ready. Be ready to swim, tumble inside my money. I'm ready to go and build a cigar fire. And we will continue from where we stop. More can boom, can boom without condom. So you're not lying to me. But no pregnancy. Yes. <laughs> I'm not. I mean it. Okay, okay, okay. Give me the money. I'll go for the abortion before tomorrow ends. Okwago. From now to the end of business today, you will get the alert. I mean hundred thousand naira will be singing in your account. Trust me. I'm be ready for more. <laughs> <laughs> Someone need to stand up. Someone need to rise. 
Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. That's getting out of hand. Our women are not slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. How was business today? Well, uh, at least we're alive. So, so. The goods didn't come in today, but uh, what can we do? Why, baby? Uh, the truck driver called to say that the truck broke down and they're trying to fix it. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I hate to hear this. I hate it when trucks break down. It happens sometimes. Hope the goods are safe. Oh well. <laughs> I hope so too. What, what can you do? Uh. You just have to trust. <sighs> so how was your day? Fine, thank you baby. Um, your brother was here to see you. That you didn't come here today. Yes, baby. What was he want? He said he needed someone for upkeep, and I. Uh... And you did what? I gave that boy twenty thousand naira last week. What happened to it? No, what did he do with the money? Baby, can I explain? Explain what exactly? That it is irresponsible and stupid that you can't see it. Do you know that Echidime has rented out the portion of the family house that I gave to him? No, do you know? Um, oh, you didn't? Well, now you know. The money that boy gets from me aids his very stupid and wayward lifestyle. It has to stop. If Echidime does not stop, I'm going to stop giving him money. What is wrong with him? That, that man that thinks himself a boy has to grow up. He's a man. He has to... He has to be productive. He has to learn to be responsible. If for no one else, for himself. Do you understand? For himself. Maybe. And stop making that face. He, he comes in here when he knows I won't be home and makes a face for you and then you also make your face that way and then the both of you begin to look at each other's faces. I'm not going to be in the middle of this. That boy is irresponsible and he must be accountable for the kind of life he wants to live. Baby, please, can you stop saying all this? What am I saying? Allow me to explain. Okay. Sure, you're shouting already. I'm hungry. Well, food, what did you make? Uh, I made pounded yam and this is soup. You promised me I found more. What happened to that? <laughs> okay, I'll soon prepare that for you. It's a promise. You promised me I found it. <laughs> I'll do that for you, babe. <laughs> I'll prepare it. I promise. Oh, uh, please let me eat something. Let me set it I saw Ife Kego discussing with your wife in front of your house. Hmm. That fool entered my house. Yes, I should be worried about that. Why should I be worried? As a matter of fact, I have achieved my aim of forcing Anita to go for the cleansing. Listen, <laughs> you can never be sure about that. Ife Kego is a terrible influence. Uh, yeah, listen. I still insist you find out why he came to your house in the first place. I tried my best to eavesdrop, uh, to, to find out, to hear even a little bit of what they were discussing. But I could not. Eh? Please, find out why, why he came to your house. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay, thanks for the information. I will find out when I get uh, home. Please. Meanwhile, what about the girl you said was coming to see you the other time? You know, we didn't discuss about it again. <laughs> <laughs> that girl, hey, that was she was she was she was extraordinary. Eh? Ha! Look, her soundtrack was so on point that even the head of them gave me a bottle of French wine to give to her after the wedding. <laughs> <laughs> hey, she them, I didn't know he was listening in to the <laughs> uh, <laughs> in that case, you will pass her to me. <laughs> 
Uh, listen, manage that multitude. You know, you have them. <laughs> when it comes, it comes when you are arrested. You have a conglomerate of uh, <laughs> of fuku. <laughs> yeah? Let me manage my little circle. <laughs> I love that one. Yeah? How did you go, Madoka? You see, Madoka, he's the forgotten issue. I have him exactly the way I want. You see that information you gave me? Oh, he went a long way in helping me to cage him. Oh, yes. that is good. You know, I paid that girl to come up with the issue of pregnancy. <laughs> <It's your cool. laughs> yeah? And as I talk with you now, eh, Madoka has already promised that girl 100,000 naira eh? for the abortion. Eh, and then uh, 100,000 naira again after the abortion. And then he also promised to take her to South Africa for vacation. <laughs> Madoka. Madoka. You see, you, see this, you see this man? This man is a very stingy, stupid man. See, if you ask a Madoka for money now, he will tell you he doesn't have money. Hey, half a one, I tell you, see, what's okay, Sessica? Ah, half a one, you're making it. I tell you, see, half a one, I say, nah, get jealous, Sessica. Get jealous, Sessica. Don't worry. But this time around, we'll deal with him. Uh, I don't uh, know how busy he is. Hey! How? Nah, man, I didn't jump. So, you are the one who plotted that. It's my way. Do you know? Oh, my, it's your appetite. Do you know I thought the girl was pregnant too? No, I'm pregnant, 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 pregnant. It's your appetite. It's always eh, ahead of time. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my, it's your appetite. I will always get there, get what I want. My name is Danger. Don't worry. It's Danger. I told you, I'm Jenna from. Come on, stop now. Oh, come on, Choma, why are you behaving like this? See, I've been following you from, from, see, Choma. Just a word with you, that's all I want. Stop! I told you the other day that I am not interested. Can you be a gentleman and respect that? How can I be a gentleman when you are playing with my emotions? Eh? Look, all I ask is just for a feedback. I just gave you a chance for you to think about it. What feedback? Eh? I said I am not going to think about it. Choma, uh, go, go. I love you. This is the drama I will not take. This is the drama I will not take. Please, stand up. If you don't stand up, I'm going to leave. Okay, fine. Stand up. What are you doing with that amateur of a guy? That guy doesn't fit you. I'm sorry for shouting. See, I love you. Just stop. Let me be. Let me be. I swear I'm going to do anything you want. <gasps> I will do everything for you. I'll give you the whole world. I just, just give me a chance in your life. I'm not interested. I am not interested. Eh? Leave me. Leave me, I am not interested. Please, let me be. Actually, you want money? Huh? What happened to the 20,000 Naira that I gave to you last week? Brother, you are acting as if you don't know that Naira has lost its purchasing power. You know if you buy anything with money again? Mm. I spent the money you gave me, so that is why I'm here for another one. Are you serious? You have spent the one I gave to you. So you come back for another one. I'm going to make it brief, slow and very clear so that you don't accuse me of not communicating. I do not have money to give to you. It's a lie. Brother, it's a lie. Brother, I know you have money. The last time me and my guy counted, we counted over 68 houses that you supply building materials alone in a building here. So how can you tell me you don't have money? Go inside and bring money from you. Uh -uh. Am I not your brother? Am I not entitled to eat your money? <laughs> Such entitlement. You're entitled to eat my money, but you're not entitled to make your own money. You should be ashamed of yourself. Look at you. See the kind of friends that you make. I do fools. So what 
you and your idiotic friends do in the morning is wake up and begin to move around over the day, counting the number of houses I supply materials to. Huh? That's what you do. You can call it whatever you like. You can call it whatever you like. I did that for you to know that I know that you have money because I know you definitely tell me you don't have money. I'm here for my weekly allowance, so give it to me. Uh, okay. I don't have money for you. Get out. What? You want to put your hand in my pocket and take it? I have just told you I don't have money for you. Get out. When I give you that money, you get out of this place. This is my weekly allowance. You must give me the money. You. Let me just take it. Let me take it. That somebody, somebody provoke you. But you give me that money. You. I will come back here at night. But you must give me that money. Ah. You must give me that money. You. Look at him. Eh? Pull it out. How can a young man like this refuse to be useful? Balo we gulu. A junior man balo we gulu. You know, I be another abom over. A jingu go. Am I worrying you? The question is. What did he come here to do? He came to see me. To see you? In my own house? Wait, you also bring men into my house? Am I restricted from having visitors? I don't understand. No, no, no. Am I also restricted from having visitors, Eluka? What kind of a woman are you? What kind of a loose, loose, promiscuous woman are you? We are still discussing what you did. In fact, we're not even done talking about what you did. And you're already doing another one. Anyway, thank God we're having this conversation because I want to tell you I will not be going for the cleansing. Ah, you must be joking. Hey, <laughs> Luca, <laughs> uh, do I look like I'm joking? Of course. You are the most clearest description of a joker. The highest joker and biggest joker I've seen in my life. Because as I speak with you, the process of your cleansing is already ongoing. <laughs> and there's nothing you or any of those your lousy, stupid boyfriends can do to stop it. Hey, look at you lie. Yeah. You lie. <laughs> so you know me? Okay. I'm a cop for alcohol. No problem. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Till then. We'll see. Oh, yeah, I tell you, Wait, you're working out on me. You're working out on me. We are like you. One name by me, and yet you are working out on your husband. Or some of us, I am one. We shall see, Mama Bassia. Don't worry. Ah, what kind of lousy, promiscuous woman can know? How did I end up like this? How did I end up like this? Why you know? I'm very sure now that you're going to one of your boyfriend's house. Leave me. Are you going to force me? No, I won't do a thing like then that. Then let me go. You're breaking my heart the more you're acting like this. Or am I asking for much? What is going on here? I say, what is going on here? Who is he? You're asking who I am. <laughs> Don't worry, you know me. But that's not answer my question. I say, what is going on here? What are you doing here? Hey, hey, noise maker. Why are you? I don't know you. But it's obvious you're nobody. You're nothing. As you can see, I'm in a serious meeting. So if you know what is good for you, just bam. I'm nobody. Hey, what? What Why, why are you doing this? Why am I being what? watched? Why can't you for once behave like a civilized man? There what? is nobody more civilized than I have warned you. I have told you, Kiwali Solomon, sir. Solomon, sir. Oh, yeah, you, yeah, you what is this thing, Solomon, sir? Oh, yeah, you're even up. Hey, are you sure Ife Kego is not having the best of your wife? Hmm? I mean, are you sure he is not sleeping with her? Ah, never. Never. My wife is the last person that will allow another man to see her nakedness. Not possible. I am very positive about this. Oh, wait, okay. Why then is, is he defending her as if they are blood related? No, why will he speak to her to the extent that on the strength of what he told her, 
Your wife has now decided that she's no longer going to continue with the same cleansing. She agreed she will take part in the form. Oh. And you're telling me that I'm not the normal. Uh, does it not boil down to what I said before? Huh? Why would a man visit a woman in her husband's house when he knows that the man is not around? I don't understand that. Yeah. Hey, Sabwanya, give me the hair. <laughs> Open your eyes! Uh, I don't know, honestly. I can say, but... No. I know my wife, Aneta. I know her very well. She's the last person that will involve herself in this moment. I mean, she's too principled for that. You, you cannot be saying that, Eloka. Hey, no, no, does it mean you're not seeing all these things happening around you? You need to open your eyes. Open your eyes and see what is possibly happening right under your nose. It is possible that the person you are believing is moving towards this direction. It's actually going this way. You don't know. I, I, well, anyways, I, I've heard what you said. I will, I will do just that. Good. And then, no, please, uh, we need to find a way to checkmate Ifeke Ego. Yes. But we are gonna get it. But the way he's moving, yeah. hey, he might spoil things. For hey, us. Not this there. is injustice. Hey, the judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? One sign wouldn't be bad. That's a bit too soon. Month edits already about the next month. Come on, please. Eh? For the sake of my business, I need to, you know, settle the books and and uh, anyway, we'll talk about that later. But what destination do you have in mind? Okay, Dubai. Yeah, babe. But then I need to get some. My name is Chooks. Mogolin Salah. An American Diobosi. I came here because of your useless brother. Okay, um, what is the problem? Did he steal your money? No, he stole little to steal my money. He broke the windscreen of my car yesterday. What? Hey, what's wrong? I, 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 I hope HDMI is okay. Oh I am talking about the whispering of my car. You're asking if your brother is hot. Oh my God! What is wrong with this boy? Is he going? He, 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 does he want to put me in trouble? Hey, uh, young man, um, please. Um, Hedibe does not live here. He stays at the family house. Um, if you go there, you'll find him. Is that all you have to say? Look, I am surprised. This is all you have to say to me. What were you expecting me to say? To you? What I have just said to you is what you actually need to know, which is the fact that you have the wrong house address. He does not live here. Do you understand? He lives at the family house. I'm tired of people coming here to complain about it. Really, he's an adult. If he commits a crime, he's over 21, you get him arrested. He's not too young to go to jail. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Don't forget, my name is Chooks. Mwogolin Salah. An American Diobosi. Okay, I'll handle this my own way. Come on, baby. This is not the right approach to this matter. And what would have been the right approach to this matter that I leak is in us? I need to understand. Let me talk to the guy. By all means, please. Uh huh. Let me check this um, site again and check these hotels in Dubai. Honestly, I can't believe he could do a thing like that to someone's car. At this point, do you still have any reason to continue with that relationship? Babe, babe, babe. That's not what we are talking about here. Look, I know you think that I hate your boyfriend. Far from it. I don't hate him. Look, that guy is so rude and uncivil for you. Chooks is a nice person. Give him a chance. I will not. Why? How can I possibly go into a relationship with a guy I know nothing about? I don't even know his source of wealth. See, I might not be a rich girl, but I am not the one who goes after money. When you get close to him, you will know his source of money. 
That's not a good advice to advise somebody. I'm not even listening to you. Let me ask you, what has this guy done to you that you detest him so much? He has done nothing to me. Say, babe, I know my guy, no doubt, has his own issue. But I love him. I love the way he is. I'm just saying it to you, my friend. So think about it. Think about it. So just a nice person, though. Before it's too late. Just relax yourself. Okay. I'm so sorry about the way my husband spoke to you, okay? Please. Your husband thinks that I'm joking. I told him, Anna Mary Gandio Bussi, I will lock up that animal until my car is fixed. I will not release him. Okay. So, how much will it cost to fix your car? Do I look like a mechanic in your eyes? Let him take you to any mechanic workshop and they will tell him the price. Where is the car now? It's parked along the road towards the Genesis Street. Okay, so I'll send our mechanic to go check it out, if possibly fix it, okay? Please. Why are you getting yourself involved? I want to deal with that troublemaker myself. Whatever happens, it's going to affect the family one way or the other. And I don't want trouble. Please. Anita, we got it from your husband that you have pulled out from the cleansing arrangement. Yes or no? May we know why? I have pondered over the whole thing. I am innocent. I did not go into any hotel room with any man. Since I married my husband in Luca, I have never cheated on him. So I see no reason for me to be cleansed. Uh, Anete. <clears throat> you see, we sat down as a family and decided that you have to go for that cleansing. For the sake of her brother, your husband. I'm sorry. But nothing will happen to your brother because I did not do anything wrong. If you do not go for that cleansing willingly, we will force you to do it. No woman can be forced into the sacred hut for cleansing. That, to the best of my knowledge, is the tradition of Obodinu Kingdom. Who have you been talking with? If I am married to a man of this kingdom and I do not work hard to know the tradition of the man I am married to, then it could be argued that I am not committed to the marriage. But I am 100% committed to this marriage, so I know everything I need to know. You think I don't know you've been talking to Efeke Ego? And I'm very sure that he is the one that has been advising you not to go for this cleanse. Well, if fake ego is a respected man of this kingdom. So if a woman is talking to a respected man of this kingdom, I see nothing wrong with it. Ah, he will soon marry you. Do you, you, you know what? You may leave. That son of a cow, Fake Ego, has been boosting her confidence. And uh, you can say that uh, her confidence is already overbloated. You know, based on what I am seeing, <laughs> she may no longer take part in that cleansing. Upe! She must do it. She must. Can you tell me? How you are going to shift that? Watch me do it. I've done the abortion. It was successful. Oh, thank you very much. So, how are you feeling now? I just feel dizzy. I feel tired. I think you should go home and uh, rest. Hmm? In the evening, you'll come out and then we'll discuss about our travel. 
Okay, well, what about the 100k you promised to give me after the abortion? Oh. Money is no problem. Hmm? I will transfer it to you. In fact, you will see the alert before you get home. Mm, that's why I love you. Thank you. I love you too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I have to go now. I have to go and rest. Oh, no, 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 no. I will drop you off, okay? Men are not slaves, so we men are not slaves. Oh, but then, I, I, are we men are not slaves, so we men are not slaves. Oh, babe. babe, so baby, I just called the mechanic mm. to tell me the extent of the damage on the car mm. and also to cost it and get back to me so we can fix it. Mm. Hmm? What? No, so you can fix it, actually. I mean, you and I. No, just you. We're not contributing to it. Okay, I'll contribute 70% of the money. I just you, need... No, you, you what? You need what? Just 30%. It right? won't happen, not from me. I'm not going to contribute even an expired Naira note. This is all on you. Because every time I try to clamp down on that young man, you hold me back. Huh? Hedgedema is your boyfriend. You deal with it. You can handle it. By the way, why is it that the young man he, he offended has not picked him up yet? She pick him up. That's the right thing to do. Pick him up. Put him in a dark cell for 10 to 12 days. When he's out, his brain will reset. Go back to factory settings. But maybe, maybe then he'll begin to, to, to behave well. I don't know. But this... This is on you. Oh, please. Relax. I'm very relaxed. Though. What are you talking about? I'm sitting up in class. Jeez. You people cannot kill me. Kill me now, you're carrying with your lives. I don't understand it. I get it. That boy keep acting stupid and then you keep defending him. Why? No, why? See, what you have to deal with now. Because trust me, I'm not going to be a part of this. Is the food is ready, let me know. I like to eat. We're just sipping on this to buy time. Let me make sure it's ready. Thank you. I want to apologize on behalf of HEDMA for damaging your car. I know you're very angry right now and you have all the right to be angry. I am going to deal with that fool. Look at that jobless idiot. I am going to deal with him and after dealing with him, I will teach him how to stay away from trouble. There's no need for that. No, 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 no. Don't tell me that. I will make sure that I teach him a very big lesson. I need a favor from you. So what's that, baby? I'm not so baby. Okay. If you say so. So what do you want me to do for you? Okay. I want you to get a mechanic to check the extent of damage it caused to your car and I will fix it. What? So where would you get the money to do that? That shouldn't bother you. Get me the quotation. I will fix it. Is this girl for real? Dang! I've never seen a girl love a guy this way before. Why am I not the one? I want to thank you all for answering to this call. It means that we can actually work together yourself very good together um, the reason for this meeting um, is simple as much as it is complicated so I just get straight to the point so that we can all begin to come up with different contributions and suggestions to help us move forward um, all of you seated here 
in one way or the other have been a victim of bad marriage. Yes. And that is why we're here. Um, your husbands have at one time or the other um, leveled false allegations against you for no reason whatsoever, just to, you know, punish you. Um, um, it's a ploy, you know, um, that is devised by men who want to intimidate their women. Um, the truth is that the men of Obodeno feel that cheating is their birthright. Uh, they cheat on their wives, yet they come up with some fictitious cultural and traditional um, contraptions just to gouge all of you and keep you subjugated. And that, I'm sorry, that has to stop. And that is why we are here today. Thank you very much. This is the kind of person we have always wanted. A voice that can speak for us. Thank you very much for this meeting. And we promise you that we are going to cooperate with you. Thank you. It's also important that you tell us the plans you have so that we know how to come in. Of course, I will, we will get to that. Um, of course, we'll all come up with plans together. Uh, this would be you know, a collective effort. But first and foremost, I just want to uh, make us realize how important this is. We're going to hit, but we're not going to miss. And in planning to hit and not miss, it starts with us understanding that this is really important, but most importantly. Someone need to stand up, someone need to rise, someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. It's getting out of hand Our women are not slaves Oh Someone need to rise and fight Hello, pretty Hello Did I just hear you say pretty? Yeah Okay With due respect I'm a lady, a married lady for that matter. Mrs. Ife Keiko, so I'll appreciate if you address me as such. Sorry, my bad, my bad. Mrs. Ife Keiko, sorry. Are you okay? Come on, it's just a handshake. I don't buy it. Come on. <laughs> okay. So I. I don't know what you really want to say. So you can go ahead, make it snappy before my husband or someone else who knows my husband sees us standing here or see you standing with me. You will not like what will happen, actually. Well, I am civil and I will continue to remain civil in this meeting. So there's no reason for your husband or anyone that knows your husband that knows you to feel bad about us. It's just a conversation, man. Just chatting up. I'll take that. English to be a genuine or polite mistake because I don't understand what you mean by us. There is nothing like us. What do you want? I mean, who are you? Sorry, my bad, my bad. Um, where are my manners? Um, I'm Jude, but my friends and my associates call me JD, but you can call me anything you want. Jude. How may I help you? I don't know. Can we just, you know, take a ride in the car, go somewhere, or maybe go to the VIP bar at the end of the street? Now, I just want us to chat in a controlled environment so that, you know, someone that knows you and your husband can see us. You know what I mean? How does that sound in your mouth? Does it not make you want to laugh? You're just meeting a lady for the first time. A lady who just confirmed to you that she is married. And you're asking her on a date. Is that not a psycho behavior? Who does that? Um, beautiful girl, I can be a lot of things. But trust me, psycho ain't one of them. 
I don't normally do this. I just saw you and I just like you. I just wanted to have a, you know, just a simple conversation. That's all. That's what I'm proposing. Nothing more. What's psycho about that? Come on. Jude. Yep. I know the man of Obodenu has made it a grave offense for one to involve police on civil matters. Let me make this clear. Don't try this again. Do not, because the next time you stop me and say this trash, you will be arrested by the police. And trust me, I mean every word that I speak. Don't do it again. Come on, girl. Come on, what? You working out? Not even your phone number? Oh, she feisty. Well, I can see why your husband loves you so much. You got class. She got class. Hey, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? Oh, but then, oh, I, I, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? With eyes full of tears, the women always crying Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us? Our men are treating us like slaves. Ah, oh, someone need to stand up. Hey, someone need to stand up. Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. It's getting out of hand. Our women are no slaves. Oh, what is going on? Someone need to rise and fight. Over the new. Hey, our women are no slaves. Our women are no slaves. Over the let it not be what I'm saying. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on, accused so if this could be cheating, hmm? our men will stop the meeting. I'm telling you. Do you know how long I've looked forward for something like this? Okamaka <sighs> indeed. There is light at the end of the tunnel. Yes, sir. His message today was the message of hope. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Because ever since I started going through this, my own deal, I have less confidence. Dear, you don't need to feel that way. Thank God for the brilliant idea he came up with. But I just pray other women does not sabotage this. Honestly, they will not. Each and every one of those women are going through something in their marriage. And looking at their faces today, I saw hopelessness. I saw women who are determined to do anything right to free themselves from marital bondage. And by the time Ife Gego was done with his speech, I saw hope. Mm -hmm. I saw joy. I saw freedom spring forth from these women. Right. Because. Most of them came crying. By the end of the message, they were all smiling. If Ekego's message is a message of freedom, of hope, and every woman should embrace it. You're right. Because me, I am the number one person who embraced it. <laughs> yes. All I know is it is time for women of this town to be given a chance. So we have to rise. This is a brilliant idea. It is. It God is. bless that man. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. So, baby, how did it go with the women? Very well. They embraced the idea. Loved it. Wow. 
I'm glad you liked it. Mm -hmm. But the question now is, are they ready for the planned emancipation? 100%. You know, I, I saw people who have been oppressed for, well, for so long and just looking for freedom at all costs. You know? Baby, I am really bothered. Why? I just told you that these women are willing to, to work with me and, and work for themselves as well. I mean, uh, not only have they volunteered to work with me on this, but they also agreed to keep it a secret, you know, to be confidential about it. So, I think that we're on course. Hmm? Babe. Yes. These people are very mean and they may decide to hurt you. You're up against men who derive pleasure in cheating on their women. And they can do anything to anyone who tries to open the eyes of this woman. Please. Yeah, but I've told you countless times that no one can do anything to me. Stop bothering yourself. Okay? Okay. So... Guess what? What? Look at me well. And guess. Are you pregnant? No way. How what? did you know, babe? You asked me to guess. Yes. <laughs> what? I am pregnant. <laughs> come. Come here. Come here. Come here. What the hell? Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to be a father. Oh yes. <laughs> this is beautiful. Thank you. Where have you been? I mean, where are you coming from? Enduka, why are you suddenly interested in where I'm coming from? Because I'm your husband. Well, you don't care. I'm your husband. Ah. And I demand to know where my wife is coming from. I see. Well, if you must know, I've been around. What kind of nonsense answer is that? Being around is not an answer to my question. Hey, look, please, I did not come here to be questioned by you. I came to pick up some of my things. Let me just pick it up and go, eh? Really? Yes. Come back here! <laughs> not until you answer my question. I don't understand why the sudden came. Like why you want to know where I'm coming from and where I've been. You are the one who threw me out of your house. You left me outside this door nights. I slept here for days, took my bath outside, knocked on this door every night for you to open the door for me and you did not. All of a sudden you are questioning me. So why are you questioning me? What do you want to know? Hey, stop speaking English. See, if you are planning to run away from the cleansing, you are a liar. Yes, because the arrangement for the cleansing is concluded and it's happening this weekend. Oh, really? Oh, yes. <laughs> well, I remember telling you I am not interested and that still stands. I will not go for that cleansing. Why are you playing with fire? <laughs> hey, look, you got it wrong. Rather, you are the one who is playing with fire and it will consume us both if you're not careful. No, it will consume you. No, it will consume us, Eloka. Because if you want me to be cleansed, fine, no problem. You lead the way. They have to cleanse you first before anybody will cleanse me. Hmm? Mm -hmm. You heard me. Do you know what just spoke now? Abomination! That's what just came out from your mouth. Mm, yummy. And I want to make sure you are punished for that. I see. Are you done? Eh? Get in here, Colombo. Who is beating this drum for this one in Bamley? Which I found out. Uh, 
And um, make sure you tell your kinsmen that if they want their wives to go for cleansing, they should lead the way. They should be cleansed first before their wives. Tell them. Who is feeding this woman with this information? They got the one in by million women. Sudden, his numbers are all switched off. <laughs> Let it not be ma that Maduka has blocked me. Else, Maduka will not like the madness I will display in his house in front of his wife. Uh -uh. Did I force Maduka to promise me hundred thousand? What's this now? Which, what, what is this now? Why is this man doing this now? Hey, Maduka will not like me. He will not like me. Okay, let me try it one more time again. Hey, it is still not going. Madoka, Madoka, you are playing with fire. You cannot play with Inketi Fekandu and go scot free like this. Good day, good woman. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, so straight to the point. I called you to explain directly to you because if I fail to do so, you might feel I'm playing games with you and I don't like playing games with people. Such thoughts never crossed my mind. Well, um, the mechanic I called for the quotation of this car actually got a Panobita involved. But the Panobita said he's waiting for a feedback from Newi. So long and short of the story is that nothing tangible has been done. Okay, don't worry yourself. They're already fixing the car, so it's going to get ready tomorrow or next. <laughs> oh, really? Then that means we should refund you then. Oh, don't bother. I don't understand, Shoots. We said we were going to fix the car. So if you did it with your money, we have to refund your expenditure. I want us to become friends. I want us to know ourselves better. That's all I want for now. <laughs> I'm married, Shoots. Come on, don't worry. We can still be friends. If you're not going to take the refund of what you spent on your car, that means we've come to an end of this meeting. And please, you men of Obodenu should keep me out of your illicit move. I don't want to be involved. Have a nice day. Not clear, huh? No, the plans of Ife Kego, is it not clear now to everybody? Are we not all seeing it? No, we will not allow that plan to stand. That decision must not stand. Because if it does, all of us will be put to shame. Uh, uh, look, we don't need to bother ourselves with this. Yeah? I have plans on ground to deal with that man. Ife Kego, I have plans. In fact, I'm already dealing with him. Whatever he planned with those women will. Collapse like a pack of cards. If you are pretty, I need to understand what you are planning. You need to expedite action. Listen to me. If we fail to checkmate that young man, like you said, 
I am afraid that he will he is going to succeed with all of this. It will not get to that. You are delaying. It has already gotten to that. See, I told you people, let us match this young man strength to strength. Allow me to attack him physically. You refused. Hey, look, there is no way we are going to allow you to reduce this into physical combat. Oh. No, we cannot. See, let me tell you, sometimes you did the other way around. You merge atrocity with atrocity and things begin to work. Diplomacy. Diplomacy is the key. We have to apply diplomacy in this time. I'm telling you we are going to succeed. Just calm down. Exactly. Calm down. Exactly. That's what I'm working on. Uh, you need to be more urgent. Be more urgent. Pour more fuel into the fire. That's it. I am on this. Yeah? I assure you, look, by the time I'm through with this, oh yeah. I'm not going to things are getting bad. Things are spoiling. Things are spoiling. You keep telling us, let us wait. Let us wait. Things are getting real bad. Put down. Watch. Let's see the results. Keep it up. I'm working on it. Uh, we are working on it. Yeah. So, I have decided to call this meeting to hear from us on what Ife Kego suggested to us. Because I am one person who has suffered a lot in my marriage. And I think it's the right time to put an end to a sorrowful marriage. Same with me. I am ready to go to any length to make sure that those evil men, they are off our neck. Do you know that at some point, I started considering suicide? Hmm. Thank God you didn't commit suicide. Hmm. I am glad that all of us have seen the ugly side of marriage. And this is a time we plan on how to set ourselves free. Yes, yes, yes. So, yes. Eh? So at this point, I think we all have made up our minds. And I like the determination in our hearts. Let's keep it up. What about the members that are not here? I will communicate with them soon. I decided to call both of you because you are closer to me. Thank you very much for coming. I appreciate it. See how long he has kept us here. Hey, okay. Sitting down here waiting for him. Waiting for him. Yeah? And I go. I see I have um, August visitors. If I can go. We are not interested in your pleasantries. So please keep them to yourself. We are here to deliver a message to you. That's why we come. And that message is this. Whatever it is you think you are planning with those women, it's not going to work. Therefore, it is better you put a stop to it now that you still have the chance. That is why we're here. I cannot make sense of anything you said. Okay, fine. I will break it down for you. What we are telling you is to stop giving those women fake hope. Because whatever you are discussing with them is as good as dead. Okay, I see. My plans with the women of Bobodin are as good as dead. Yeah. And you two run to my house. Scared and worried. Can you not see that your actions have betrayed you? The plans are dead and you're here. Both of you really should be ashamed of yourselves. You want to keep our women in bondage perpetually so that men like you can continue to be promiscuous and then no one questions you. I have an advice for both of you. Do not unleash onto other people's daughters what you do not want unleashed on your daughters. If you can go. If you can go. Hmm? I mean, that's if I called you. In a pajanya meme. In a. We are going to forget that you are a man of our town. We will deal with you decisively if you fail to put a stop to this nonsense right now. That is the message. 
fear is all I see here. Fear. Men like you want to keep our women subjugated and come up with a lot of traditional and cultural jargons just to keep them in bondage. Your time is up. I've started to put an end to it. I've started to put men like you in check. It will not happen again. It ends now. In that case, something bigger than you can imagine will happen to you. And it's imminent. Mark my words. Oh, well, before it happens, uh, both of you would have to go for cleansing. Yes. It's actually the both of you that need it. Get out of my house. Out. Listen, get out. You walk me out of your house? Do you know, I thought I, I don't want to go here. I told you. I don't walk me out of your house. Why tell me? Ha! I thought I want to come here. I don't want to come like this. What is it now? What? Hmm? I, get... I don't even know why you're doing this here. I mean, why? This is my house, so what's the problem? Would you live here with your wife? Yes. So why are we doing this here? Because I have the right to do whatever I want to do in my house. This is my house, so feel free, okay? In fact, you've proven to me that you're different. I mean, this town hall is different. <laughs> this is not Blala Blue, you know? <laughs> so, I'll go make some food for us, eh? okay. and then we'll go for the second round. It will make sense. What do you think? Ah, I know you like it. Yeah. Hello, girl. Yes. What is this? What are you doing here? You're asking me what I'm doing here. I mean, why are you biting into my house? What's your problem? Hello, girl. So now you bring women to your matrimony. Oh, she's even she's even going inside in my house. You bring women to your matrimonial home. Yes. Because your wife, Anietie, traveled to Eke to go and see her people. So you now bring women. Hi, hello. I am glad you know that this is my house. And I'm doing what I like to do in my own house. So why don't you get out, go to your own house, and do what you want to do there? Mua, get out. Yes. Mua, get out. Makaneche hello auto. Hello, ka. Well, it is not fair. Well, it's obvious. Hey, look, you are wicked. Well, it's obvious you have nothing meaningful to say. You are wicked. Oh, yes. You are you're this jobless. You right? are very... Men no, of you, you know. are jobless. I'm in jobless. In a, in a, in a, going to people's house to poke your nose in things that do not concern you. Are you that jobless? Why do men like you take pride in, in cheating on your wives? Why? How is your business? Why? Is your business? Hey, well, it's my business now because I have seen you. Uh -huh. Oh, let it be on record that I have seen you. Hey, okay. Which guy monkey record? Who cares about your record? Oh, Keep yourself, I, 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 oh, 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 you have nothing meaningful to it's say. It's all right, no problem. Uh, go, go, go. One day you are going to care. Let yeah. me be on record yeah. that yeah. I have seen you. So, I'm talking that you're still going inside to go and meet her. It's all right, no problem. No problem. We'll see. See, Choma. If you continue being angry with me, it won't help me in any way. I'm not enjoying this visit. Since you've decided to continue doing the things that I hate, I would not advise you again. Hmm? That means you never loved me. Eh, hey, now. You never loved me. You're not making a mistake. Yet you still want me to continue making that mistake. You cannot succeed in weakening me with emotional blackmail. This friendship is no longer working for me. I just want you to give me a break. No. No, don't say that. Mm -mm. Don't say that. Yes, there is nothing like giving you a break. Okay? You're not going anywhere. We stopped here together. We're in this together. Okay? You're not going anywhere. Wait. Don't tell me it's because of that guy, you. Yes. Don't tell me it's because of that guy. Because if it's because of him that you are acting this way, I will kill him. Mm. Because of you, I will commit murder. 
We're not going anywhere. I don't understand. You hurt me so much and you don't know about it? See, if I hurt you, I've apologized. I'm sorry. <sighs> but my decision <laughs> still stands. We're in this together. No leave, no transfer. You're not going anywhere. Okay? You have accepted to be my girlfriend. I won't leave all these things for another person to come and be enjoying. It's not possible. <laughs> so please, learn how to get used to things with me. Okay? Please. Anyway, give me water, let me drink. Give me water now. What was the meaning of that nonsense you did earlier? Do you know how much I paid that babe to bring her home? You should be ashamed of yourself. Hear what you're saying. You should be ashamed of yourself. Are you not ashamed? Hey, look, are you not ashamed? Are you talking to me? I'm talking to you. And when you're talking in my house, you bring your voice down. I built this house when I had any money. Uh -huh. You put it in one block. Walk him. You're the one who needs to go for cleansing. For you not only stink, you're evil, perverted, and wicked. Fake ego. You fake ego. I'll get him. See, you are beginning to bite more than you can chew. And I assure you, it's going to break your jaws. I have very strong jaws. I can break all kinds of bones. So do not worry about my jaw. I was born ready. If you can. Ha! Do not say we did not want you. Do not say you were not warned. You know, you men go about town cheating on your wives and you do not want your wives to cheat on you. I think that your wives should cheat on you so that we can balance out the equation. How do you reason? How? Now, I'm beginning to understand you're not mentally stable. Who married who? Do women marry the men or the other way around? See, if you can go, let me warn you. Stop smuggling those rubbish, those nonsense into those women's brain. Uh, hey, look, I know you know your problem. You have an ancient mind. And you think this is 1929. You, you are entitled. It's wrong. Women are human beings just like you. They have feelings just like you. So you cannot cheat on them and expect them not to cheat on you. And when you have your suspicions, it's a problem. No, come Why on. Why didn't Jacob wear no? Uh, Why didn't Jacob no? Uh, and you forget that you're answerable to her as well. Come. If you go. Oh, Dini, what can I understand you now go from house to house. Poke your nose into things, matters, affairs of other men. Things that do not concern you in any way. I, I do go from house to house actually to weed out promiscuous men like you. But your house, I'll never bother. Your wife already has you in her booking port. Listen to me and listen real good. If it's about our women getting the desired freedom from your draconian setup, trust me, I'm never, not in this lifetime, going to back down. Then you're going to burn. <laughs> you are going to burn. I want to man to hang up. A woody city. Why? Okay, man. Why? Opposing Kitalicians in the SLBU. This is injustice. How can I pay for a sin I never commit to you? Hey, this is injustice, yo. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, yo. Where are the treats, hey, Where are the upright men? Hello, beautiful soul. <laughs> You even look more beautiful now than the last time I saw you. What's up? You again. Do you live here or have a shop around here? Oh, no, 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 not at all. You know, I remember your threats the last time. I just want you to know that I mean no harm. 
and if I gave you the impression that I meant any harm to you, forgive me. I don't mean any harm, baby. I don't know what you're planning, and I don't know who told you I was coming to the plaza today. But I must warn you, and I want you to take this very seriously. Stay the hell away from me. Um, see, I get the sense that we are quarreling. Are of we? course we are quarreling, if you don't know. Is that so? Yes! What is the cause of the quarrel? Did I miss something? What's that your name again? Jude. Oh, Jude. Jude or JD, whatever your name Oh yeah, JD, you remember? Yeah, of course I do remember. I don't have time for all of this excesses. I warn you again, stay away from me. Okay, 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 wait, wait. No, ma'am. So let me just tell you the truth. I'm just gonna go for broke and tell you this. From the first time I set my eyes on you, I don't know, I just, I just fell in love. Even the moment I left you the other time, you were the only thing that comes to my mind, even up till now. I can't explain it. And I remember telling you the last time you tried saying this trash to me that I am married. And how do you know my name? Oh, come on, I do my homework. I also remember telling you that being married doesn't stop us from anything. Yes, all you just have to do is say yes to me and let me do my magic. You're saying all of this because cheating is very normalized in the, in the life of the men of Ubudeni. But I must tell you that I, Nyoma, Mrs. Ifekego, is not wired like that. I would never cheat on my husband. I, I know your husband. Your husband is a very busy man. I, I, I know his schedule. He doesn't have time for you. He doesn't deserve you. You know the man that will wake up every morning and serve you breakfast and stay beside you. Trust me, if you say yes to me, I will be giving you unhindered orgasms, baby. I see you're very jobless. I'll advise you get a life. You're sick in the head. Very, very sick in the head. Hey! What am I gonna do again, baby? Well, this game is hard to get. What else am I going to do now? What kind of woman been if this? I've said every possible thing that a man can say to who a woman. <laughs> Why is baby by baby? I beg. Yeah. Hey, what are we? What are you doing? Madoka, so this is where you are. This is why you've not been taking my calls, Madoka. Please, please, we can go out there and discuss. We are not going any outside to have this discussion. We are discussing it here. Hello. Who are you and why are you creating a scene here? Are you alright? Let me tell you, if you know what is good for you, just mind your business. Sit this your big ass here and don't talk to me. You must be very stupid. You must be very stupid to tell me to shut up and sit down. Are you okay? Are you mad? You are the one who is mad for interfering in what does not concern you. You are the one who is mad here. I don't think you know who you are talking to. Who are you if not a man's snatcher? What? You are yeah. a man's snatcher. You just called me Ugone a yes, man's snatcher. Yes. Me? Yes. Me? What are you doing? Hey, hey, hey. Get this out of here. Why are you people for you to stop? I have this. I have this. Let me finish this. Stop. 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 Let me do with her. She's I mad. She's a man.
Paragraph. What are you doing here? I've decided to join you in your business. Say that again. You heard me right. So when are we getting started? <laughs> Ah! Hey, Chidi, man. You're not joking, are you? I'm serious. Yes. <laughs> this has got to be the best decision you have made in all your life, I tell you. And I hope that you take it seriously. Eh? So, when are we getting started? Listen, let me tell you. If you keep your head down and learn the trade, it won't take as long as you think. Honestly, in less than what, 18 months? I'll settle you. You know, I'll put a big shop for you, stock it up, and then you, you can be on your own and have a good life. Life is not that hard, Ichidimi. Stop being strong headed. You have a very beautiful destiny, if only you can just apply yourself. Anyway, today's not a day for lectures, but congratulations. Thank you for your promises. Bro, brother, you have not told me when I'm starting. It's fine. Um, come by my office later this afternoon. So work out a schedule that fits you. Huh? Good afternoon, Chu. Oh, how are you? I'm okay. I thought you've gone back to Inugu. Uh, not yet. I made up my mind until the first phase of my building is completed before I return to Enugu. Uh, you asked to see me. Oh yeah, um, it's about your friend. I don't know, she's giving me tough time. I know it was going to be like this. Don't worry, just keep pressurizing. I'll be compelling her. She will succumb. <laughs> you see, that's one thing I like about you. You, you. you have this ginger spirit. You yeah. keep giving me hope. Yes. <laughs> so, you, you think so? Very sure. Sure? Yes, very, very sure. Okay, no problem. You see, Send your details to my phone and I'll credit you. Thank you. I trust you. I know what you can do. See, I am Chooks Mogolin Sala. Chooks, Chooks. And I'm Eric and the Obosi. I trust you. I'm on Sunday. I trust you. Credit. I will. Thank you. Are we men and not slaves? Are we men and not slaves? Obo Denu. I, are we men are not slaves? Are oh. we men are not slaves? With eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? Let's What are you doing here? Where is my wife? What kind of question is that? Are you kidding me? Do I look like the keeper of your wife? You think I'm joking? No, you think I'm here for jokes, right? Now let me tell you. If I wait for my wife till tomorrow and I don't see her, you will know my true color. Let me not say it tomorrow. Ah, oh, okay, so that's so, so, so poor. Uh, um, brother. Open the gate for me. What is he saying? Ignore that tout. Open the gate. From all indication, the chapter of HDMI has been closed in your life. So it is time to open another one. Babe, if you're talking about me moving on with another man, I will not. Are you going to remain like this for the rest of your life? No. And there is time to move on. Look, Chooks loves you. And he's not coming to you for a relationship. He's coming to marry you. See, babe. This Chooks market you're trying to sell, it will not sell here. Mm -hmm. I guess you hate that the guy so much. Far from that. Why will I hate him? Then give him a try. No! I am not interested. I enjoy your truth now. Joma! Huh? Why, why are you so uptight? Hey, hey. 
Give this guy a try and see what he can do. I don't understand you. Leave me alone. This guy will change his job. This is job. I'm very okay with this. I will not give you water. If you ask me for anything, I need water. Sure. I will not give you. Let me. smile on your face. Yeah. <laughs> what happened? This shows good news. Well, something good happened today, surprisingly, I tell you. Talk to me, baby. Your man, H.E. Demon, showed up here and told me that he's now ready to join me in business. It's a lie. I'm telling you the truth. I was just about getting to the... I saw him standing I'm like, why are you here? You know, in our usual fashion, I thought we are going to have a face off. He told me, no, I'm not here with trouble. I have made up my mind to come join you in business. I'm like, say that one more time. He repeated it. I'm like, okay. Sounds like you're serious now. Oh, my goodness. You know, you have just made yourself the best decision ever. You know, so I told him to come by the warehouse later and uh, get acquainted with the staff. And surprisingly, he came around. I'm telling you, I introduced him to the manager, sales staff, everybody. He just clicked with them one time. Wow. <laughs> now, this is the surprising part. The big part is that he made a huge sale today. Yes, some guy showed up, uh, wanted 32 pieces of aluminum doors. I don't know how he did it. He convinced this guy to buy 32 pieces of wooden doors and pay cash. Babe. I'm, I am as shocked as you are. That means he has some marketing experience. Would I put it that way? I, I think he's got the, you know, the street thing, there was the way he was talking to this guy, you know, you know the language, you know how they talk in the streets, I don't know. Well, he sort of connected to the guy and was able to convince the guy, whatever, but we got the money, you know. Oh, but if he's serious, um, I think he has a bright future in business. He can just keep his head down. Oh, babe, <laughs> I'm so happy. Like, seriously, all I want for him is to be straight-headed and I think that will work for him. Mm -hmm. Right. <laughs> I'm so happy with you. I know you're happy. <laughs> yes, yes. You don't start. <laughs> but that's the truth. That your boyfriend finally has a job. Baby. Your man. Baby. He your guy. <laughs> Stop it. He finally has a job. Eh? Mrs. H.E.D. <laughs> I have heard a lot about you and I thank the gods for the blessings they have given to the Kingdom through the works of your hands. Thank you, Ramos. Thank you. I must say that it's an honor to have a man of your caliber in my home. Given your very tight schedule as a chief priest of the to have you here is an honor. <laughs> Honestly, it is not an honor, it is your right. I gathered you visited my place yesterday, but I was not around to see you. It is only right that I come to you know why you visited me. I am with the Niger <laughs> Uh, as Alice in truth, there's a lot of people who see it differently. <laughs> Okay, but I'm already here. So why did you visit? Um, it's Alison. I came to you with a case of injustice meted out against the women of the day. I had wanted to involve the police, but then I remembered that um, there's a law that says that uh, issues concerning officers, the people of the day, must first be treated amongst us before taking to the police. But what exactly is the problem? Um, I am going to tell you. But first, I would like to know if the gods of Obodenu have decreed that 
our men can maltreat their wives without consequences, if that's part of our tradition. Well, I, I would like to get a detailed story so I can be guided by the girls in my orphans. Yes, Alusi, you are aware that most of the men we have in Ukudeni are, are philanderers, very promiscuous men who cannot even go a day without cheating on their wives. But it is natural that uh, what KJZ no has the right of having concubines. It is their right, and um, uh, no one can take that part away. No one. I may agree with you, but but is there a law that says that uh, these men who cheat after cheating would not have their women come and pay, pay for their sins, you know, uh, and take the fall for them, you know? <laughs> Because I don't understand why why they do that and still ask their wives to go for cleansing. It is not part of our tradition. In as much as it is in their nature to um, cheat, they, they, they should do that and uh, not subjecting women to slavery or making a woman scapegoat. That shouldn't be called. That should be stopped. Exactly, that's my point. If a man is so classless to cheat on his wife, now let him cheat, but let him be the one, you know, to pay for his sins. You know, and not try to drag the wife into it. It is only men of weak spirit that are always interested in intimidating women, uh, making a woman escape good and all that, which, uh, which, which is, uh, the tradition is against it completely. Our tradition is against it. I'm happy, I'm happy as I said that, you know, we're, we're, we're thinking along the same lines. Because, because as it stands, you know, these men go out to cheat on their wives. And then try to get the women to come go for cleansing. I don't get it. So what I'm suggesting is men who go ahead to cheat on their wives and then want their wives to go for cleansing so that they can technically get them into taking an oath. How about them? you know, leading by example as the head of the house. So they should go there, take the oath first, you know? But you are just right. That is the way it is. If a man feels his wife cheats, uh, he should have the courage to approach the sacred stone and take an oath. Mm -hmm. Swear that he is very sure of what he is saying. Exactly. If a man fails to do that business, he is not sure of himself. And should let the woman be, should leave the woman alone. Exactly, it's Alice. You have all these elders who know nothing about our tradition. You know, prancing around and, you know, uh, making life difficult for these women and hiding behind tradition to commit atrocities. It's, uh, I am happy you're saying this, it's Alice. And I am going to get them to come and listen to you and hear you say this directly. I'm going to tell them that you have demanded to see them. Oh, yes. So many of them may not be able to come to me. But never mind, I know how to handle it when the time comes. It is fine, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. There is nothing you will ever tell me that will make me listen to you. You are a wicked man. I regret everything we ever did together. <sighs> Ugo. Ugo ne. Why are you talking to me like this? Is it because of the useless story she told you that, 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 that make you call me names? Oh no, you know she's a liar. She is not a liar. You had something doing with her. Uh, yes, I had something doing with her. But we've ended it just like people end things. I, I don't just know why she don't want to leave me alone. For the first time in my life, I saw myself fighting with a woman over a man. A married man for that matter. Well, I came out here to see you and to tell you that it is over between us. Don't you ever come here again. Excuse oh, me. Oh, no, no, no. Ugo. Uh, Ugo, baby. Can't you understand? I love you now. I don't love her again. Hey, you're my sweetheart. You're the woman after my heart now. Huh? 
please listen i i have made reservations somewhere please let's go there eh, under controlled atmosphere we we, we can jolly and and, and, and settle this i problem. have nothing to settle with a married man go back to your wife and don't you ever come here again don't you ever block me again Hey! Kid no din so good here. Huh? This this sweet babe. I will go mba now. I I I can't leave you after just one outing. You know you know how to do this thing. You you know how to do it. You go, I beg, I beg. You, you, you will never escape. Never. <laughs> I have not started dealing with you. I have not started. Ugamba. 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 are you now a spirit? Why are you stalking me? <laughs> Leave me alone now. Leave me. Leave me alone. I will keep stalking you until you fulfill all those promises you made to me. You see all those promises? All of them. You will fulfill them. One after the other. Today. Here and now. Else. You will not be able to recover from what I will do to you. Eh? Eh? Where are you going? I'm still talking. You want to walk out on me? Nkechi. On I go. What is wrong with you, I mean, what is he planning to achieve? Now he wants to preach us against the priest. He has already done that. That is what he has done. You are saying it. I am going to teach that young man the lesson of his life. By the time I'm done with him, he will be regretting why he started what he is doing. My question is, how do you intend to do this? Since he has gone to the chief priest. Listen, you see, every single man has his price tag. The man can be bragging because you have not decoded the price tag. You see the chief priest? I will invite him over. And something is going to happen. This case is going to turn against that fool. Good. Good. Turning the table against him is the only way to end his rascality. Exactly what I'm going to do. Yes. By the time I am done with Ife Kego, he will be regretting why he decided to stand on our ways. Oh, no, I cannot wait. I mean, my happiest day will be the day I will see this young man on his knees begging us. Begging, probably crying. Uh, eh? Please, whichever way or measure you want to approach this, get me involved. If it has to do with money, let me know. Tell me my own contribution. I can even double it. It is going to happen. Very soon. Exactly what is going to happen. And when it finally happens, we are going to invite him over. Make him to nail down. Hi. And then we will give him condition. You are very positive about this. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> this is injustice. Oh, eh, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey, oh, where are the truth sayers? Where are the upright men? Oh, where are you going, Benaja? You know, you are that one man of this kingdom who has continued to attract respect from all. You are that one friend of mine who I hold in high esteem. You are that one man who has continued to speak for the gods of this land. And I, I feel so delighted that you honored my invitation. Thank you for coming, sir. Can I tell you the truth, Mr. Uh, go ahead, Mr. Alice. I'm listening. Uh, please, can we sit down? Men who walk on the path of injustice and wickedness cannot be friends to the priest. I, 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 don't, I wouldn't know why you would say that. <laughs> uh, this is still me. Hey, I, I am still the same man. 
uh, the same one that you hold as your friend. I have not changed. You can ask people. I am still the same person. Uh, why will you say this? Under your watch, as they will know, the Prime Minister of this great kingdom lose men for body and kingdom. Succeeded in bringing untold punishment upon the great women of this kingdom. That is why I'm here. I have come to see you because I want that style stopped. Are you, are you sure you are not mistaking me for someone else? Uh, this, you just said that I'm the know who of Obodenu and that is correct. I am still the know who of Obodenu, that upright man who has not done anything wrong. Uh, why are you sounding this way? Women of Obodenu and women married into Obodenu are not slaves. Sure, I agree. They have their rights as human beings. And no one can take such rights away from them. If any man feels that he wants his wife to approach the sacred room for cleansing, such a man will first and foremost approach the sacred room for an oath taken. Such a man will take an oath that he is very sure that his wife has defied herself. We don't live on assumption. No man should live on assumption and thereby cajun his wife. Uh, well, as I will say, I actually packaged something for you. <laughs> And uh, if you permit me, I will just go and get it, so uh, we can get into the discussion proper. <laughs> Sorry for keeping you waiting. <laughs> that is for you. It's just a small token. You know, you are one man who has continued to work for the gods of this kingdom, and you have been working so well. Uh, this is just something I have packaged for you, you know, to make you feel okay, so that you can continue to work for the men of this kingdom as a man. You know, what I am saying in essence is that you, you need to use your good offices as the priest, to make things easy for the man, uh, you know, so, so, so that they, they can operate freely as men who are the owners of the land. You, you, you understand what I'm saying? You, you know, you know, you know, there's no need you know, pushing the man to the wall where they will be so frustrated. Yeah? Even the whole just like, hey, you can live work easy. For it to be easy for the men. Yeah. This is for you. Let's have a boy of you, Zodima. With you, Gabenaja, my good friend. Map one, you broke on our own. Gaza Maka, my manager, and you, Makanu Gode Benaja. I don't need your money. Keep your money. The gods are for the men, the same way they are for the women. Don't ever attempt to bribe the priest. Hey, it is not bribe. And, and why, why will such word come into your mouth? It is not bribe. It, it, it is just something I have given you, you know, from the depth of my heart. Because I know you work so much for the gods. You are not working, you know, for the money. So people like us who work so much for the money should be able to take care of people like you. You understand? That is what I have given you. It's just for you to, you know, feel happy as you are doing your job and make things easy for the men. That's all. I have delivered the message. Do the needful. Do the needful. 
But you are forgetting something here. What is wrong with this man? Yeah? This man has no money. And he is rejecting money. Cash. In this cashless economy. What the hell is going on? Why are you dragging me like this? What in God's name are you doing? Are you doing my Eh? I am here for the money you promised me. The what rubbish money are you talking about? I am here for the 100k you promised to give me after the abortion. You even said we were going to travel. Which God knows I was never going to travel with you. But you see the cash, the 100k. That's what I'm here for. I must collect that one. Look at you, you're mad. <laughs> you think you can reap where you did not sow? Let me tell you, Gechi. I am no longer interested in any relationship with you. Upe. Understand that. I know. You're no longer interested. Same as me. I am equally tired of this nonsense we've been doing. Maduka, this is the second time I'm, I'm confronting you because of this money. The third one, I will involve your wife. And I will do it in a way that you feel like killing me. But let me tell you, ten of you can do nothing to me. Maduka, that is what I am. You can do nothing to me. You're just blabbing. You're just blabbing. Okay. Get out of my compound. I will come again in front of your wife. I will come again. Try me. I will come again. What type of faithful spirit is this? Huh? This girl will not kill me. Oh? Uh, so, Chief, uh, how did it go? He turned down the money. Hmm? I offered him. He actually walked out on me. He came all the way to your house and still turned down the money. Hey, look, the way he actually approached the issue is not good at all. He was very mean, very mean and unapproachable. So, why did he turn down your money? That man who has been standing before deity all his life, he actually wants the right thing to be done. So, what exactly is he planning to do? The same thing we have been avoiding. That's what he wants. Any man who wants to catch the wife through the process of cleansing must have to make himself available and take an oath first. That he is sure that the wife is not that the wife is actually cheating. I don't understand. That's what he wants. He said, I mean, how could he say that kind of nonsense? Is he okay? I don't understand. Are you giving up very easily? We need this man on our side. If not, I'm waiting right now. Hey, Luca. You know, I never give up on anything. I pursue things to the end. But leave this one. I know how best to approach him. How? I don't know. How are you going to approach him? Is she happy there? You don't understand. I gave this man 400,000 naira cash in this cashless economy. He rejected it. What else do you want to give him? He gave you cash and rejected it. We transfer him. Yes. Transfer him to our side and transfer him. In fact, transfer his entire worldview so that he will see things from our own perspective. And then he will fall in line with us. So we transfer his very personality to our side. Hey, are we men are not slaves? Are we men are not slaves? I've been looking for you. Now you have seen me any problem. I want you to stay away from Madoka. 
Stay away from Madoka. He is my man. Hey, <laughs> wonder I thought you have something important to say. And listen, Nkeshi. Listen. This will be the first and the last you pull the stones and stay away from Madoka. It's mine. He is yours. How is he yours? Are you his wife? He belongs to me. Aside his wife. And there is no other third woman. <laughs> Get? Daydreamer. Wake up from your dream, Unne. Wake up. Thanks. Baby, you don't walk out of me. I am talking you not to walk out of me. I don't want to. You're looking at me as if you don't like me. Huh? The truth is that it starts gradually. And with time, I assure you, you're gonna like me. <laughs> um, you know, it's this very stupid attitude of yours. I mean, this nasty attitude of yours that make people feel you cannot call the police on civil matters like this just attitude. Why are you talking about the police here? Huh? I'm just here to let you know how I feel. I already know your husband's timetable and I know your husband will not be back yet. So you don't have any reason to be scared or worried. Wow. Just wow. So, automatically you know I am married. Huh? Right? Yes. Very good. And because you know my husband's schedule, you have the nerves to walk into my compound and tell me you like me. Are you not stupid? Like, are you not daft? You are just being too rigid, huh? Calm down, loosen up. All these ladies you look up to, they all have bangers by the corner. I assure you that whatever we share is going to be kept secret. So, I've had enough of your stupidity. Right about now, I want you to get your ass out of my compound. I will surely leave your compound, but I just want you to listen to what I have to say. Um, you know, you're not the only one who is hitting on me. So, I won't be wrong if I say this whole thing is a plan deal. <laughs> a plan deal? Oh no, call that crap, I'm bigger than that. My name is Kennedy, like I told you earlier on. I am here for real business. What I feel for you is real and genuine, okay? And also, I want you to give me a chance in your life. I'm going to give you remarkable memories. I'll take you to places you've never been before. Um, please remind me your name again. Kennedy. Okay, Kennedy, whatever. I, I think you know my husband, right? Of course, yes. You see how built he is. Like his physique is tall, he's handsome. You know my husband very well. So I'm wondering what gave you the nerves. I'm wondering what gave you the mind to step into my husband's compound to say and spill trash. Before I close my eyes and open them, I want you to take your sorry self out of my house now. I said no! I will leave your house, okay? You don't have to yell at me. I will leave. But I just want you to look into what I'm here to say. Get the hell! You have, you to, have, think, no... you have to think. Come on, get out of my compound. What's, what's, just look at you. I will give you remarkable memories. You know, Rich, do you know who my husband is? Remarkable. Come back here. A guy now, wow. Now, what to you? You just forget your guy. I don't talk you, they laugh. Mm, just, you just cast for this hood. I know they see you again. What did they play? My guy. Don't be say, I don't want to see you. But just that, these days, I'm always busy at the warehouse. You understand? So that's why I hardly come out. The warehouse? Yes, the warehouse. You have been busy at the warehouse? Yeah, my brother's warehouse. Okay, the warehouse. So as it is like this now, you don't forget about your worker. 
You don't forget about John, Dabi? No. Who are you? I never forget, though. Uh, the point is that since my brother refused to help me, uh. you understand? And I can't reason now. See, if I didn't show up, all of them join. I'm part of making the money now. But I have plans. So. If he can go say he will settle me after eight months. So my plans be say, if he settle me, I will gather the money. I don't move. 18 months? Yes, now. One, two, three, four, ten, eighteen. Eighteen months? Yeah, yeah, six months. I don't move. I know say this way they talk like this, I know be you they talk out. Because I they, I they get feeling say trauma, trauma has a hand in this. She talked you into this. My brother not be trauma. I'm telling you, as a matter of fact, I have not seen trauma for a very long time now. I have not seen her. So I'm not be sure. I just make up my mind. Say instead of wasting around, let me just get myself busy with something. You have not seen trauma. Not seen her. I don't understand why now. She broke up with me. She woke up one morning, say she's no longer interested. I let her be now. Just like that. Just like that. Trauma where you they always follow. Pium pium pium. Here, there, here, there. You you know. Finally, you now let her go. I just told you now, say she woke up, say she's no longer interested. A woman says she's no longer interested. What does it mean? Go your way, I go my way. Then I let her go now. What do you want me to do? Should I force her? No. How would I force her now? Mm. You understand? It's alright uh, now. Uh, uh, another thing is this openly. You know now that I have engaged myself in doing something, I think it's high time you do the same. Yes, now. You want me to join you at your brother's shop? No, you're not joining me. You're a criminal. Get something to do. <laughs> you understand? Because now people will be seeing you that. I, 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 I'm now, I'm now okay. I'm behaving normal, but I'm still moving around with the criminal. You, you, you be idiot. You be idiot. You, you be, be my idiot. guy. You are behaving normal. They try to let me know, say, I, I they abnormal, Abi. No, I mean you are, you are jobless assistance now. So get something to do. Guy, I go enter you. I go enter you. I go enter you sharply. Once more, you are welcome to my place. Thank you, great one. So, what has brought you to my place? A great one. Uh, here, here. Take this. What is this? A great one. Why not open it and uh, see for yourself what it contains? Yeah? Open it. See for yourself. Eh? Happy <laughs> yeah, great one. Happy tea. I don't have time for this. What do you have inside? Ah, okay, yeah, great one. Great one. You see, this envelope contains documents for 20 plus of land. 20 plus of land. Uh, in fact, uh, your friend, you know, who knows that I've been. And what business have I got to do with papers of 20 plus of land? <sighs> with, uh, you see, right now, these 20 plus of land belong to you. They are all yours. Yeah? Um, in fact, your name is on all of them. Yeah? Uh, but we want you to do just one thing for us. Just one thing. Any woman of Obodenu who is accused of infidelity must go for cleansing. But the husband of that woman shall have absolutely nothing to do with the process. That is all. That's why we brought this one. Yeah? Apiti, have you seen a madman since you were born? <laughs> madman? There are madmen all over the place. Yeah? In fact, I even saw one while I was on my way to this place. Uh, I mean, what has a, a madman got to do with uh, what we are talking about? Uh, if you don't leave here this moment with these cost papers of yours, I will make you run mad. It has not gotten to this. Yeah? 
Yeah. We are still talking. I, I really want you to see things from our own uh, perspective, our own point of view, so that uh, uh, things will be properly handled uh, in Obudin. Uh, you are the authority here. Uh? There is only one thing that will make you believe that it has gotten to that point. Is this. Animals. Okay. What happened? Hey! Obwe Phil wanted to strike me with madness. Eh? What happened? He rejected the young gift together. And when I tried to pressurize him, hey, the man flared up. Wait. That means if Fekego has succeeded in turning his mind against us. That is what it means, sir. Hey! That is what it means. Yeah. So, how are we going to do this? Anyway, I already have a plan. Mm. Yes. Now what about that? Yes, go. Please, speed up with your plan. No worries. If not, we are finished though. No worries, again, man. Trust me. Mama, we shall be. You smile for me now, man. Not until um, you tell me what you are still doing with that rascal, big girl. <laughs> Amaka, my Yoli Yoli. Eh? My Tata, you know there is nothing again I have to do with that idiot. Eh? I have nothing in common with her again. Then why is she still embarrassing me and telling me how much of you? She did what? She knew it today. Like. Madoka, mm -hmm. tell her to stay away from me. Okay, it's all right. I'm sorry if that is what she did. I know how to handle her. I know exactly what to do. Okay? You have to. Hmm. <laughs> I've been yelling my smile now. Look at me, look at me. Look at my smile for me now. Smile. <laughs> You don't know what it does to me when you shine your teeth. Eh? You think they touch me? Eh? Yeri, yeri. We'll, we'll drive out now. Eh? We are going to a very conducive environment to, you know, now at least. Eh? Yeah, I guess I will give you. Oh! <laughs> this one, you're not kill me. Our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Obodenu, ay, ay, our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. I greet you too, young man. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine, thank you. And who are you, and what can I do for you? Okay. Firstly, uh, I'm Mr. Kennedy by name. Okay. And I've been willing to see you and talk to you about something that if you can do for me, I'll be very, very grateful. All right. Uh, let's help. Let's hear. Let's hear you. Let's see what it is. Uh, I, uh, I, I like your wife and I want to make her my wife also. Uh, sorry. Uh, please say that again. I just said, I like your wife and I want to make her my wife also. Oh, here she comes. So beautiful. Uh, hold on. You, you say you like my wife. Yes. And then you want um, to make her yours. Well, uh, I can understand if maybe I didn't present the matter well to you. I know you must have invested a lot on her for her to look so fresh just like a yesterday virgin. I want you to name your prize. 
whatever the amount is, let me know. I'll pay it. Hey, 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 hey! Are you mad? Uh, don't worry. I'll handle this. Young man, you, you came to my house to insult me? Oh, no. That's okay. It's fine. You can leave. Oh, I won't leave here. Hey, hey. I've heard everything that you've said. For now, leave my house while I think about your, about your demand. Just, just go. No, I won't leave just like that. You have to give me an answer now. Any amount, I'll pay you off. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Man of Obodenu should leave me alone. Man of Obodenu should leave me alone. If this is a ploy to see how far I can go. You should wait for me, I'm coming. Where are you coming from? Hey, look, this is my husband's house. And I am back to my husband's house. If my husband wants me to be cleansed, then he has to present himself first to be cleansed. And when he is done, I will present myself to be cleansed too. Really? Yes. Whoever is feeding you with these useless and stupid ideas is lying to you. Because it does not work like that in this kingdom. Yes, men of Obodenu do not go for cleansing. <laughs> when will you people be tired of this lie you have cooked up to intimidate women with, to hold them down with? Because I know the truth now. I am talking about what the chief priest said about a situation like this. Yes. I read it in the women's platform and it states that if you want me to take an oath that I cheated on you, first you have to take the oath to say that you saw me in the hotel with the man. And when you are done taking the oath, then I will take the oath to defend myself that I was not in the hotel with any man. That is how it works. And whenever you're ready, my darling, I'm ready too. Wait, who put this nonsense, this, this stupid lie you just told now, who put in the women's platform? It is not a lie and you know it. Because if it were a lie, the chief priest would have refuted it. But since he did not refute it, then every man of Obodin must abide by it, including you. Anyway, like I said, when you are ready to be cleansed, I am ready to. This is not the calm, gentle, and peaceful and yet that I am married. Who even put her in that woman's platform in the first place? How did she get there? Hey. I don't like this. I don't like it one bit. Look, all the logistics needed for the execution of this project we provided. Why did you fail? Why? Eh? Uchi, she is very hard to get. That woman loves her husband so much. She can't be enticed with material things. So, what is the way forward? Chi, you need to take it the hard way. I was going to say that. I was going to say that. But, the issue is, are you guys ready for it? Whatever ready, 100%. As long as you're gonna foot the bill. Money is not the problem. Money can never be an issue, as far as I'm concerned. The point is, are you guys ready for it? 
like we told you, hundred percent we're ready. Okay. Um, yeah, listen, this night, eh, all your individual accounts will be credited. I want you to commence with immediate effect. See that this job is executed. I don't want excuses, please. No excuses this time around. Ichi, immediately we get the money. Consider the job done. Hundred percent. This night, like I said, your individual accounts shall be credited. Eh? No excuses, please. And um, see that you communicate with Jude. Okay. Then we can leave. Please. No excuses. <laughs> Iche, 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 Apiti One. Iche, this man pays very well. Iche has an agenda, and he will go at all costs to achieve his agenda. I wonder where he gets all the money that he gives to us. <laughs> Iche, Apiti is not alone in this. He will surely have some money bags behind him. Hmm. <laughs> chooks, chooks, mo go go. Mo aneli kandi obosi. Uh, you're making up this. Does it look like I'm making this up? Of course not. I mean, my husband came to me the other day telling me that his brother was ready to join him in the business. Wow. <laughs> so it works. Of course it did work. And all thanks to you, my darling. <laughs> you're welcome. So where is he? Well, he's busy in the warehouse, you know, trying to pack things, arrange things. Okay, so I will stop over at the warehouse to see him later. You should. You know, your presence is very important. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so right about now, I should be leaving, you know, fix some things before my husband comes back. Sure. <laughs> Take care of you, okay? Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. All right. <sighs> Don't be too excited. <laughs> I, I, I should. So my baby finally turned a new leaf. God, you did this for me. You deserve all my praise. Thank you. I will praise you. I will praise you. I will praise you. I will praise you. Hey! If I can go, are you going to claim? You don't know what men can do when, when they feel their ego is bruised? I don't see why anyone's ego should be bruised here. Oh no, we are talking about women here. Our women. Women married into our land, we owe it to them to speak up for them. It's our duty, it's our responsibility. Oh no. Do you understand what you are doing if I can go? No, 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 you are trying to teach our women the dynamics of power. If they manage to understand what you are teaching them, they will not use the power well. Why don't you understand this? And men who presumably understand the dynamics of power, what have they done with it? If not use it for their personal gains. I can't sit and see something going wrong and not fight it and not talk about it. Oh no, and if this is the reason you have invited me here, I would respectfully ask that we do not carry on with this discussion. I'm sorry. I, 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 I need to understand this. Are you telling me you are sitting before you know of Obodem? And you are telling me to my face that you are not going to obey my orders? No, you have not given me an order. What you have done is try to coerce me into aligning with you to keep our women suppressed. That's what you're asking. And I have said no. I will not do it. And I stand on what I have said. You stand on what you say? Without apologies.
Babe! Babe! Hey! Hey! Who are you? Like I always tell you, it does not matter. Hey, baby, please, 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 please don't hurt me, please. Ah! 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 No, since he does not want to leave us alone, we are going to touch the very heart of his life. Yes. Are you sure this is going to work? Why not? It has worked already. I don't know why I am not very comfortable with this whole arrangement. Same with me. Uh, maybe because I have not done this before. Listen to me. There is no cause for alarm. Eh? This is something I have done before. I have done it over and over and over. I will still do it any time the need arises. Yes. Don't bother yourselves. I'm in charge. I'm on top of the situation. Yeah? Baby. Baby. Sweetheart! Babe! How did it happen? I don't know. 
has the kidnapper contacted yet? Yet. Okay, I'm coming. Where, where are you going? Let me see if I'm coming now. Come. They are calling already. Hello? We have him. Ah, oh, that's good. That's good. Um, hold on. I hope you were not followed. Not at all. Oh, okay. Okay. Um. Oh, we have to meet immediately. Eh? So I'll tell you what the demand is. Yes. Uh, you need to put a call across to the husband. Where is the meeting point? Um, that road that leads to the Anglican Church. What time? Right about now. In fact, I'm already on my way to that place. Yeah? All right, Iche, I'll catch up with you shortly. Yeah, quickly, quickly. Yeah, yeah we don't have time to do this. have to go and do today. Good, I've already. Yeah? Mr. Wadro, the demand. Remember, remember the demand. You will be able to Let me. No, no. Are you comfortable with this arrangement? If you know, like Mona Bana Monori, I never knew that the Shia Petit has always been a kidnapper or this while I wouldn't know. Just said that he has been doing it. Be careful. I mean, one has to be careful with the people you let yourself with. Shia Petit. Yes. What's the next move? You will call her husband. Tell him to stop whatever he is beheading for the women of Obedin. If he wants his wife to return to him in one piece. I don't understand you, sir. We're not supposed to be asking of money. What money are you talking about? Did I not give you guys money? This is not about making money from him. No. We don't need his money. It is all about teaching him a lesson. A lesson he will forever remember. Hmm? Good. So you call him. Tell him to stop this fight. He is launching against the men of Obodenu Kingdom. Otherwise, his wife will be returned to him as pieces of meat. Packed inside the sack bag. Tell him that. Is that all you want? That is all. I'll do it. And I know you can do it. Please, sir. Please. Whatever I've done, please forgive me. I'm begging in the name of God. Please don't kill me. Please, I'm begging. Keep quiet. Okay, sir. Okay. Nobody's going to kill you if you behave yourself. Okay, okay. What if you don't? Hey. You're as good as dead. I'm sorry. Please, I'll behave myself. Please. I'll behave myself. Hey. Rule number one no talking, no movement. I want this place to be as quiet as a graveyard. Mm -hmm. Understood? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Please, 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 I'm begging. Shut up! Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Ichi. You get what I want to ask you now. She get quanta with anybody. No, not at all. What about your brother? You know, see, he get as your brother they do. He get as in we be, we are not understand. Your brother get enemy anywhere. Bokotele, my brother is a peace-loving man. I don't think he has enemies. No worry yourself. No just worry yourself. We will find her. And we will see her. 
Je fini so. Baba, you must suicide, you be. You must suicide. Appreciate you. I go day for you. Just like you've been there always day for me. I believe you. this that question does not matter because in the course of our discussion you will get to know who I am okay who are you okay I'm listening to you we have your wife what please 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 I beg you please 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 just don't just, just don't hammer her please I beg you please please don't touch her please shut up if you ask me one more question without my permission If you ever want to see her alive again, you must jettison the movement you just initiated to ridicule the men of Obodenu. If you fail to do that and let the women know that they belong to their husbands, your wife will be returned to you in a bag cut into pieces of meat. Hey. Okay, uh, can, I, can, I, can I talk to her? Please. You have ten seconds. Hey, hello, baby. Hey, baby. Um, how are you? Are you okay? I'm okay. Baby, please oblige them. I want to leave here, please. Hey, Mr. Man, uh, your time starts now. Hey. And if by two days you do not get to see that movement, I will kill your wife and hey. come after you. Hold on, hold on, listen. Hello? Ow! Damn! Huh. Please, 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 sir. Sorry, sir. Please, please, please don't kill me. You quiet. Hey, this is injustice. Hey, a judgment passed in the favor of men. Hey yo, where are the truth sayers now? Where are the upright men, Lord? Oh, but I am a savior. You are not hungry. Why? I've lost appetite. I don't want to eat. Oh really? I guess you want to go home. Yes, sir. Please let me go home, please. I'll tell my husband to stop whatever it is he's doing. Please let me go. Please. Until your husband does that, that is when you will leave here. Oh, God. For now, since you don't want to eat, I have to eat now. Hey, God, I want him. Oh, God. Madam. Yeah, you, you have a choice now, Abby. They are serving you food. You don't want to eat. If I hear pain from your mouth again. Sorry. Sorry, sir. We heard what happened. We were so sorry. But have they contacted you? Yes, they have. So, what are they demanding? They are asking that I jettison the movement for the emancipation of our women. I thought as much. Are you going to do that? Never. If going ahead with the movement, you put the life of your wife in danger, then withdraw from it. Exactly, please. No, never, no, 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 never. There's no backing down, there's no way, there's no way that is going to happen. If indeed there is, there is a God of justice and a God for the down, 
flood. This is when that God should rise up. Our women cannot continue to live like this. No way. There is no way evil is going to triumph over good. I say no. They have my wife, yes. But this movement must happen. I don't ID the boys we run that movement. Who are they? Funny enough, they are from this same kingdom of ours. Wow. I wish I bad news. I be the same old who did the we know the streets. My ears, they always dig ground 247 for any 411. Okay. Are they 100% sure? Okay. Okay. So how do you track them? Follow me, make I show you. Follow me. Oh no! Oh no! You can not pretend to be ignorant about what is going on right now. My wife is missing. I'm asking you, where is she? Do I look like your wife's keeper? Do I? Oh no. Oh no, you're nearer your end. You know, but they know that you know. Oh no, I just want to remind you that men who think that they have become knowledgeable must not forget that they were taught by someone. They are learners, oh no, and their teachers are masters. I don't know what you're talking about. They are learners, oh no, and they are, their teachers are masters. I don't know what you are talking about. What I am talking about. They are masters. They are children. So the ones that they think that they talk. I have my eyes on you. What I'm going to teach you is a lesson you're going to learn the hard way. That age has nothing to do with wisdom. My very beautiful wife will be coming back from the UK today. And I wouldn't want a fool like you to show his face around here. When my wife is around, if that happens, you are not going to like how I will handle you. See about what? You call me a fool. What I mean? <laughs> oh no! You and your cohorts came together and kidnapped my wife so as to force me to jettison my plans of liberating our women from the bondage that men like you have created just to put them in check. Huh? But I tell you that that check is coming. And when that check comes, men like you will fall in line. You are a fool to stand before the you know who of Obodonu and use such word. I am the masquerade that is presently leading the way and nobody can force me into any line. Uh -huh. No one can force you into any line. Can I call him? I could hear you want to work as a possession. Get out of my face. Get a lesson, Sinah. It's a level. This is injustice. I am a man, a man, a man, a man, a How can I pay for a sin I never commit? I've been thinking about something. Huh? As long as you are not getting any good pay. Any good money from this job, eh? Mm -hmm. What if we chop that woman? Sorry, Chris. Are you are you sick in the head? Nah, that thing. Don't tell me you're possibly not in the idea of eating somebody's wife. Huh. Baba, we don't see that. Uh, somebody's uh, wife, somebody's wife, somebody's wife. Does it matter? Nah, check this thing on. Does it matter? It does not matter to you. One night, it matters a lot to me. What are you saying, bro? It matters to me. Ha. Ha. Since when did you start having cold feet? Eh? See, bro. 
You know why I'm only doing this because I was paid to do it. The same here. So uh, that I'm paid to do it does not mean I will, I will go as far as being among the group that actually rapes a woman. No, no, no I won't go. I won't, I won't take it that far. Come on. Man, see, listen, eh? This woman, she's already vulnerable. She will do anything we'll ask for her because she wants freedom. She wants to leave this place. Now nah, check what this woman oh. Have you looked at that woman? But I don't hold you for body. Have you looked at that woman? You don't see that woman? Oh God, she. If you want to eat her, go ahead. You have the green light. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not like you're coming to take permission from me. I'll be in a trees of you, they fight. Come on. Come on, Mimi, you go. No, nah, I'll be trees of you, they fight. Go and eat her. But I will not be involved. Please, don't involve me. Nah, nah, you know, nah, you know, nah, you know. I hope you're chopped and see why, bro. Come on. Ha. Oh, wow. Our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. Robo Denu. Ay. Ay. Our women are not slaves. Our women are not slaves. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying. Cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us. They don't even care. I still can't believe that something like that could happen in this town. This man are behind it. So why are you not involving the police? This is no longer a civil case. It's a criminal offense. So you need to brief the police. I can't be thinking of the police right now when those boys have my, my wife in their, their, their custody. Right, I'm, 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 I'm applying wisdom here. I'm, I'm following this up gradually. But I'll have you know, and anyone who cares to listen, that whatever my wife comes back to tell me that those boys did to her, I am going to unleash on the owner where his cause in multiple folds. So what is your plan for our return? I have a plan. I might not give you specific details, but trust me, I have a plan. Oh, have you eaten? I have appetite. Okay. Um, what about your brother? Is he aware of the happenings? Yes. Uh, no vex, I block you under this hot sun. You understand? You get waiting who your man wear wear for neck. I don't know if I feel get ten k from you. I beg. I don't understand. As Mpage, what makes you feel like I have the money here? No be no be like that. You understand? I just get waiting choke me where well, where. Well. If you don't even get the ten k, any way you get, it's well. It's okay by me. You understand? You don't smoke? No, I don't do smoke. I'll just give you two K. No wala. Man, no carry and buy cigar. No wala. Baba, thank you very much. You know, boss. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind. It's getting out of hand. Our women are no slaves. Oh. Someone need to rise and fight Robo Denu Hey, our women are not slaves Our women are not slaves Robo Denu Hey, our women are not slaves Our women are not slaves With eyes full of tears The women always crying Cause they've been cheated on a cue so wrongly Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us? Our men are treating us like slaves oh, Someone need to stand up
Someone need to stand up, someone need to rise Someone need to speak up and add the women's mind That's getting out of hand I'm not hungry Do you have to eat? Not hungry I don't mind her they hear me so. Hunger will still catch up with her. And once that happens, trust me, she'll go beg for food. She'll go beg. That is always the issue. With them, she will definitely beg for food. Hello, since you're already here, let's go and pick up some things. You guys should hurry up. Of course. And be careful. We are not spending much time. Before you know it, we are back. You better eat now that you're still alive. You speak gently, sir. I know you cannot hurt an innocent woman. Please. Please, I'm begging in the name of God Almighty. Let me go, please. Shut up! Zebe! Please come to my rescue. Please, God. Do you know any of them? 
which I find suspect. And I suspect some of those guys that boys come on to me as a son. You don't have to worry yourself. You know them. It's a good thing that you are back in this house. So go in, take a shower, and have something nice to eat. We'll handle the fools. And I, I also think you may need the doctor's attention. You're right. Um, brother, you're going now. It's a good thing you came out I felt it in my spirit that they were going to be here. They didn't touch you. They did not touch you. Going to deal with this man. He didn't just say that. I mean, how is that possible? Hey, I thought you said that they are professionals. Eh? How did it just happen? So what's going to happen now? Yeah, where are we going to hide? There is no hiding place for a criminal like you. You are very heartless, Eloka. You are very heartless. What did you just say? You heard me. I said you are heartless. Because you want to suppress the truth and keep women under and keep suppressing them not to enjoy their liberty as human beings. You decided to kidnap an innocent woman. Hmm. Well, look at your cup is full. Be careful, just as woman. Be careful. Uh, Who told you I kidnapped anybody? Uh, I don't need to be told. The vigilante group you set up to arrest criminals are here to arrest the real criminal. You people can call me now. Agnete. I did not do it. Hi, Agnete. Agnete, you get mind. Okay, your husband. Way. I did not do anything to you. You get mind. Mm -hmm. Anita, do this to your husband. Husband, wicked and heartless husband. A bad man. Move. Move. Move him. She's not my cat. See what we're dealing with right now. I said it, no one cared to listen. It would not have cost you man, anything at all to let our women enjoy their freedom and peace. No. Huh? We have to control everything. Huh? Relationships are built on trust and not built on coercive dimensions as your cleansing represents. Did I not talk about it? Oh, I talked about it. I cried. I cried. I talked about it. I came here several times to talk to you about it, but no, you didn't listen. But look at both of you now. Huh? You have shot yourselves in the leg. We don't have to waste time here, sir. Oh no, and the sheriff. I have the order of the police to arrest you for kidnapping. Are you out of your mind? Uh -huh. No, no, are you out of your mind? I am the owner who of this kingdom, and I am the one who is in charge of the vigilante. Oh. What makes you think you can arrest a man like uh, me? Oh, oh no, calm down, calm down, calm down. Uh, I'll find the Abalumba, whatever needs to be. It's not a shouting matter, calm down. Uh, you'll have to cooperate with this man. Oh yes, they have been sent here by the police. Uh, do not use this arrest. Or man the man that the police shows up here now. That they can walk here now, can I walk in now? Man like here, uh, who come here now, mess here up. Just go with this man. Cooperate with them. Cooperate with the vigilante that you incorporated into this community. Join them, go with them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I can go. If I can go. Look, they are a fool. You are a big fool for rising against your kinsmen. In fact, I promise you, you will regret this. You will regret it. Uh, just like you're regretting your very dirty ploy to have our women in bondage for the rest of your lives for your own selfish reasons. Look at you. Each other, look at you. You have done the crime. You are going to do the time. Huh? No, no, no. Who, who the hell do you think you are? Who the hell do you think you are to believe you can jail a man like me? Uh, listen to me, please. Come shouting at me. Uh, uh. Listen, you don't have, you've lost it in this community. As far as this community is concerned, you, you've lost it. We don't have respect for you anymore. When people are talking, you know, you cannot be talking. For you do not have the interest of our people at heart. Uh, 
What do you now him back as if you're a man of authority? No, you have lost your place in the hearts of the people. Do your job. Push this man out. No, move. 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 Oh, you should have to move. Move where? Okay. Move. 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 Someone need to rise. Someone need to speak up. And Eddie will be smiled. It's getting out of hand. Our women are no slaves. Oh, someone need to rise and fight. Go for the new. Hey, our women are no slaves. Our women are no slaves. Over the night, I, I, we men are not slaves. So we men are not slaves. With eyes full of tears, the women always crying, cause they've been cheated on, accused so wrongly. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna stand for us? Our men are cheating us, they don't even care. Who's gonna speak for us? Who's gonna fight for us?